guys, I hope your season is off to a good start. Mine is off to a great start. I could not be more happy with the start of this season. Last week was the first week of the grind and it was a unicorn week. I had five practices in a row that were all phenomenal, moved me closer to my goal. That kind of thing happens maybe a couple times a year. I'm gonna share that week with you next week, next episode, so stay tuned for that. This is basically like the Truman Show at this point. It's just constant feed of, <laughs> of what's going on. Also stay tuned at the end of this episode, finally got that Halloween uh, animated video together for you. It's awesome, check it out. But today we are going to talk about the three types of back to breast turns and how to do them fastest. Here we go. The first turn is the most common, touch and go. Now the biggest mistake you can possibly make with this turn is to touch flat on your back because then you just have to sit all the way forward, move all that body through the water slowly. Most swimmers know to at least touch on their side when they do this turn. You are allowed to be at up to 90 degrees perpendicular to the water before you touch the wall. And then once you touch the wall, you can be however you wanna be, and we'll get to that in a second. But you wanna be at 90 degrees. The most common mistake that people make with this turn is this. They touch on their side, great, but then they swing the whole side of their body through the water, which is a ton of resistance. The best, fastest way to do this turn is the moment your fingertips touch the wall and you're on your side, you immediately get to your stomach and swing your knees in, treating it just like an open turn for breast to breast or fly to fly. The second turn is the backflip, and there's a big advantage and a big disadvantage to this turn. The big advantage is that after you flip, you are flat on your stomach, and that is the strongest way to push off the wall. The big disadvantage, though, is that you are pushing the whole broad side of your back down through the water, and that is a lot of resistance. But if you're gonna do this turn, the fastest way to do it is as you reach in, reach down, so that once you touch, your hand is about a foot below the surface. So you've started the process of flipping even before you've reached the wall. It's just like in freestyle. When you swim freestyle into the wall, you're not gonna be at the surface when you tuck and flip right before. No, that's, that's not as fast as gradually submerging yourself a couple feet before your flip to make it as smooth as possible. The third turn is the most intimidating, the crossover turn. People try this and they end up sideways and upside down and pushing off into somebody else's lane. They go, screw it, I'm just gonna do the backflip or the touch and go. But if you can master this turn, it is the fastest way to go. There is a reason most of the top IMers in the world do this turn. So let's talk about how to make it your turn. When you do this, unlike the touch and go where the touching arm is beneath you, in the crossover turn, the touching arm is on top of you. The key here, and you have to be on your side when you do this, it does not work if you are less than 90 degrees. So you gotta be at 90 degrees. But the thing that really helped me get this when I was trying to figure it out was somebody told me, treat it like a freestyle flip turn once you touch. And just like that, I got it. So as you touch, get to your stomach and start leading the way with your head, pulling your body through the water, which is a lot quicker, by the way, than pushing the whole broad side of your back through the water. Now to do this like a pro, you've just gotta follow that tip I gave you for the backflip. As you are reaching into the wall, reach down so that once you touch, you're touching about a foot below the surface and you have effectively started your flip even before you have touched the wall. And when you do this right, ah, oh, it is a thing of beauty. It looks like a flip turn. It looks like your hand doesn't even touch the wall. It is so smooth, in and out, boom. Those are my tips for back to breast turns. Let me know if you have any of your own, especially for that dreaded crossover turn. Here is that animated video. Go check out our suits, they are awesome. But either way, good luck with your swimming. Swim different.